What up, Bloodhounds? I'm Preston. I'm Jacob, and we got our special guest, Skelly! And HGTV starts right, right now. now. Halloween's just 17 days away. Halloween? That's my favorite holiday! Speaking of Halloween, Skelly, did you know Scream's 25th anniversary is this month? Wow, Jacob, I didn't know that. Well, here's Brianna with things that you need to know. Good morning, Bloodhounds. I'm Brianna, joined by Skelly, who's being a little quiet right now, with today's things you need to know. A-Team is looking for members. If you are interested in quiz bowl type questions or participated in A-Team in the past, please stop by room N48 for more information. Practices are held Friday afternoons from 2.05 to 3 p.m. Yearbooks are currently available for pre-order. Stop by room 501 to get additional details. Skills USA members will now meet every Wednesday in room N02 from 2 to 3 p.m. Teachers, if you are planning on doing any exciting activities and labs in your classes, please reach out to us. Good morning, Bloodhounds. I'm Mr. Bruno, the principal here at Auburndale High School. I'm in our college and career fair today. I have with us our college and career coordinator, Ms. Giles. Ms. Giles, will you tell us how many programs are represented today here at AHS? Absolutely, Mr. Bruno. Good morning, Hounds. Um, so today we have 30, 31 colleges and different vendors from around our county, around our state here to make connections with our students at Auburndale. All right, Ms. Giles, that's a lot of people here on campus this morning um, to help our juniors and seniors about how to go to post-secondary or career opportunities. What, why is it important to offer these opportunities for our students? So college or life happens after high school, right? So we have to have a plan. And if we don't start planning now, it's like it just kind of happens right after graduation. So the hope is that students will begin making their plan um, for post-secondary or the career force. All right, and also, Ms. Giles, one last question for you. What is your role here at Auburndale High School in getting this college and career fair going, but also what is your hope for the outcome of it? Um, again, so I, I want students to be able to make connections with our different vendors around our city, um, around our state, so that they can have a plan for post-secondary. Um, it, it took a lot of prep, so I hope that the students find it beneficial, and I hope that um, we have something positive that yields from this experience. Thank you, Ms. Giles, and once again, it's fabulous as always. Thank you. What have you found interesting about this college and career fair? Um, I think it's really interesting because you get to see a bunch of the different colleges that you can apply to, and especially as a junior, kind of thinking of what I need to start doing for next year. Okay. So you talked about being a junior and that it's important to think about next year. Elaborate on that. So why is it so important as a junior to start thinking about it until, instead of waiting until your senior year? Well, the sooner you can start thinking about it, the more chances you have to take your tests, like your ACT and SAT, and just making sure that like, you're ready for college and you have that mindset. So I know this is maybe on the spot, putting you on the spot, but what colleges are you looking at? I saw you kind of mingling around through the colleges more. What are you really looking at? What, what college is just in your heart? Um, just really any university. I really want to cheer and dance in college, so I'm still keeping my options open. But All right. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Amron, and appreciate everything that you do here at HS.
That's all the announcements Skelly and I have today. We'll see you next time.